Welcome to PPT Jax. So let's start with the tutorial. Here, first of all, we are going to insert the video. Okay. So first of all, I'm going to take this video. I'm going to bring it to the corner of the slide and stretch it to the slide size like this. Okay. Now in the next step, in the playback tab, I'm going to trim the video as I don't want the whole video. So I'm going to cut the beginning of the video like this and I'm just going to press the OK button. Done till here. Now let's go to the animation tab and select play. Go to the animation pane and start it from previous. Okay. Now let's go to the slideshow. Here we are going to pause at the end of the video and we are going to take the screenshot. So in some of the uh, computers the screenshot is taken by pressing the window key and the print screen and in some of the videos sorry in some of the computers it is taken by pressing the function key plus F6 key so here like this I have taken the screenshot now I'll go to the slide number two and I'm going to press ctrl plus V so I have the same image over here now in the next step I'll go to the picture format. I'm going to change it to the black and white. And in the artistic effect, I'll just give it this kind of effect. Now press Ctrl plus V one more time. And I am going to give it some border. And somewhat like this. Alright. Now in the next step. Select this picture. Go to the animation. And in the animation, we will give, we will give grow or shrink animation. And here, let's start it with previous. And in the effect options, instead of 150%, we are going to shrink it by around 80%. And let's have a full smooth start and press OK button. So it's going to happen like this. Now, to both the slides, we'll give the transition effect, that is non-transition. The duration is going to be 0.1 seconds. We'll give some sound effect of camera. And instead of on mouse click, we'll go for automatically after. Yes, so on you can insert as many slides and as many videos as you want. Let's go to the another slide so for that let's delete the slide number two enter and have a blank slide now we are going to have some blank slide okay so let's go to the design option let's format the background and let's give some color maybe we'll give this color all right now in the insert we'll give the picture i'm going to add the splatter image from my device which I have downloaded from Pixabay. Alright, so here I have it. To this, I'm going to give the animation of room or shrink. Okay, so let's go to the animation pane. Let's go to the effect options. And instead of 150%, I'll just give it 90% like this and enter. Let's have a full smooth start and press OK button. The same animation is going to start with previous. Okay. Now, as I have taken the screenshot of the sim video, now in the next step, what are we going to do? Go to the remove.vg. Here we are going to upload our image. So I'm going to upload this image. Okay. Now here we are going to remove the background of this image. You can do it directly on your PowerPoint or you can use Photoshop, whatever is suitable for you. I go for it because it's very easy and simple to use. Okay, once it is done, we can download the image. All right, and click save button. Now we are going to insert our downloaded image. So let's go to this device, and here we are going to insert our downloaded image like this. Now pressing the Control key plus Shift key plus dragging our mouse button, we are going to increase the size of the same. Okay, now go to the selection pane, select the picture number two, 
go to the animation tab and click on animation painting now we are going to click on our this picture so this picture will also have the same animation but here we'll do some changes so go to the animation pane go to the effect options and here instead of 90% let's go for 110% and then press ok alright now let's help preview for the same